Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Bella here. In today's tutorial, I created this makeup look for you guys. So if you want to see how I achieve the look, then go ahead and keep on watching. So today I went in with the Disney Mulan palette and this is what the packaging looks like on the outside. It's super pretty and this is what it looks like on the inside. There's a good variety of matte shades and shimmer shades and there's even a pressed glitter as you guys can see, the top gold shade in the middle. And I really, really have been enjoying this palette. The first shade that I went in with is Fighter and I just put that in my crease with a big fluffy blending brush. Not being too precise, just adding it in the crease area, just going in circular motions and back and forth motions. And this is pretty much going to act as the background shade before we go in with deeper eyeshadows. Next I went in with the shade Strength which is this matte brown shade and I just took a defined angled brush and what I've been doing lately is I have been wetting my brush. I know it sounds kind of weird to be wetting your brush with a matte shade but trust me you don't have to go back in and add depth over and over. It just works for me so I've just been using this technique with every single look. And then I went back into fighter and I just went in circular motions directly over that line. And if you need to, you go in with the deeper shade and kind of mix the two shades till you get the blendedness that you desire. And then for all over the lid, I went in with this glitterly obsessed body glitter from ColourPop and this is in the shade Fresher Than You. And this is what it looks like. I really like these glitters because you don't have to use a glitter glue separately. You just go straight in with the brush and it stays wherever you apply it. But I will say that these glitters aren't meant for the eye, but I've been using them on my eyes ever since I've received them. So yeah, they work for me, but if you have really, really sensitive eyes, I would definitely think twice about it so it's just something to keep in mind so moving on to the lower lash line i just went in with that transition shade that we first applied to our crease and the lashes that i used by the way are from amazon i'll try and find the link and put them down below and then i went in with strength and i mainly focused that shade on the outer corner of my lower lash line and then i went in and blended those shades out and the very last thing that I did was I applied some lower lash mascara and this is a finished look guys. I really hope you enjoyed this super quick makeup tutorial. If you did, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!